Hi guys, Trinity here. So I was inspired to show some of my sacred spaces. Um, so I'm going to show them, but I'm not going to show you the whole house because some of my other sacred spaces, um, I live with, I have a family, so family can be messy and I'll just leave it at that. So anyway, this is one of mine, my Ganesh altar. See my Ganesh, and yes, you can melt herbs in there, which I tend to do. And then in the back, tea light goes there, and the herb smell comes into the house. I made these witch boots as an incense holder. Okay, here's my chakra banner. This little guy, believe it or not, I found at a consignment shop. And um, sometimes he holds siege. I don't have any in there at the moment. My Himalayan salt candles are all over my house. I charge jewelry on my altar. I find four leaf clovers all the time. I find them outside of stores, outside of doctors, outside my house, and I tape them to paper so they don't die. Anyway, this is my little door into the next room that I can show you. It's not messy. That twisted stick, um, I made that. I made that into a walking stick. This is my little, this cabinet, I got it like a garage sale, and I wound up painting it and put my witch symbol and all my witchiness to it. Crystals, I have crystals everywhere. It's another little sacred space I have. Spilt some candle wax on the wall there. This is, beyond this curtain is my magic room. But it is very compressed because I do not have a lot of space in this house. This is the entryway to the room that I read in. And I have my screen up right now. So, anywho, without further ado, this be my magic space. So, it is just jam-packed with so much flavor of my very precious things like my fairies, my dragons, my books. Um, I have a lot of healing books and, and it is just packed. I have to get another place so that I have somewhere to put all this. So I'm going to have to kneel a bit here. Hearn the Hunter and Bridget. Every part of this room is going to be covered in crystals. This is like a fossil dish. This is salt, either rhodonite. This is sodalite. No. Oh. I don't know if any of you have ever seen candle quartz. But this is candle quartz. Uh, here's a better. Almost looks like it came out of a cave. Anyway, I have a lot of cool things in here. My generator. Um, I love selenite. I'm a little bit of a selenite freak. But, like this book I made. I make a lot of stuff, so... That, it's my incense burner, comes out his nose. I'd have to pull him out to show you, but you take a piece of his nose out. These are sage bowls, um, dishes to burn herbs in. Oh, my little cabinet's unlocked. This is where I keep extra stuff in my tarot journals and whatnot. 
this little witch. Let me see if I can turn her on for you. She lights up. There we go. Check her out. Isn't she cool? Anyway, there's things in here I made like this. Um, hang on. I made him out of pottery at one of my pottery classes. Um, I do hang some of my jewelry up here, and I will charge it there. Or I charge them on my altar. This cabinet is filled, first of all, with my turtle salt lamp, my pyramid salt lamp. Um, that's a wand. That's my son's. I'll show you his stuff in a minute here. It's hard to see because the backing of this cabinet has a mirror and it's kind of reflecting. But that was my grandmother's set in there. I don't know if you could see that. There were just these little pieces, so I got a board and glued all that stuff to it. Um, you could see my petrified wood between the girls here. Red selenite. There's some moss agate in there. I have a lot. I didn't put all knickknacks in here because I have some in the other house. These are all my herbs. I have quite a bit. And spray bottles. Those are my ritual brooms to sweep stuff out of here. This is my crescent moon mirror, which I love. My son's stuff. He has a whole cabinet to himself. This is stuff that he's collected, and I've bought him over time. Um, this is his singing bowl. This is mine, but I put it here. This is I charge stuff in here, too. Um, but this is his little sacred space, except for the stuff on the wall. That's mine. Okay. My cat sleeps in here. Her little bed is in here. So I made this cabinet. Once again, I picked it up at a yard sale. And I looked at some images on either a book or online. And I painted it on here. That cabinet, <clears throat> excuse me, again, a yard sale. And I decorated it. Um, this is my oils and some resins. And this one has just got various things. This is a shelf for stuff that when I get a bigger house, I'm going to be able to put up. The one Ganesh moon has a symbol on it that I don't like. And I, I really despise it. And when I looked it up as to why they would have put it on a Ganesh Buddha statue, because when I bought it, I didn't see it right away. Um, it was saying it meant bless, bless your way or, or to be blessed or something, and that's not how the world sees it. So since it's made of metal, I'm going to have to glue something over it because I don't like it at all. I made that werewolf. There's a little bit of dust up there, guys. Sorry, I got a dust up there. I made him out of air-dry clay, so some of his pieces have fallen off. Um, I don't know if you could see my witch and my chakras poster. That's my blue moon water um, and full moon water. Whenever there's a full moon, I make my own water. And then I use it when I burn herbs in the house. Trying to give you another view. Now, my tarot decks. And this is my little dragon eye box. This crystal, I cannot believe I got in Salem and it was very cheap. I was in shock and it's a real crystal. I'm positive. It is clear quartz. This is just a bath bomb. In here, rooster quartz. I get a lot of interesting different stones. And then I take something like this, which is rough fluorite. 
and I will make it into a heart. These are some stones my son got. It didn't come out of the plastic yet. But anyway, there's fluorite in here because I love fluorite. There's all kinds of lovely little things in there. There's rose quartz, there's obsidian, there's amethyst, there's rooster quartz. Anyway, this had a bowl to it and it broke. So I just put this beautiful ashtray in it. I will not use it as an ashtray. There's sage. These are my little mortar and pestles. Now, the tarot cabinet. These are all tarot decks, guys. You cannot see how many decks there are in here because they're all in bags. So, you just can't appreciate how much is in there. And some of them are not in there because I put them this side for trade or sale. Um, but yeah, so... This is my magic room, and, oh yeah, I know what I wanted to show you. Some of my stones and my little, I love this otter, yard sale. This is my generator, and my selenite, and my smoky quartz, and I don't know how my hair got over here. If you're wondering what some of these are, ask me in the comments and I'll tell you. This is probably one of my most favorite pieces of fluorite. And this one. I got ink or something on my hand. Um, these guys, I don't know if you can see them. This is a goldstone elephant. I think that's steatite, the turtle. Fairy on some amethyst. I have an amethyst frog there. A goldstone um, little turtle. That's my wolf. Rose Quartz. Oh, I went into a local metaphysical shop and let's see if you can see it. I bought this Phantom Quartz. It's got these inclusions in it that are wild. Yeah, you can see some there. Everybody in there talks about this piece. There you go. Because they're like, you got the best piece. Every piece that's come in after has not been the same. So it's called Phantom Quartz. More smoky. So I can't make every space in my house um, kind of like magical like I want. <laughs> because it's just... Too much with my family and everything. I'm always afraid stuff's going to get broken. Oh, one other thing I did want to show you. This is a nice athame. That's my other athame. But, because I don't keep them on my altar. There's just not enough space. Um, this is my crystal wand that I made. My grounding stone. This is leather. And this is another favorite piece of fluorite of mine. So I make a lot of stuff. Um, I do have some more selenite wands in there. But they're just like... Okay guys, I just wanted to show you my magic room and sacred space. Because I said I would. i see you later. Show me yours. If you like my channel, guys, like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye-bye.